Hi, good morning my dear students. Yes, last video we have so many notes we are going to discuss in front of you. And another most important question, when they are asking A and B are the two values are. So how to find out the values? Let us discuss one by one. So here the first, try to understand the question. Find the relation between A and B. Find the relation between A and B. So that the function f defined by the greatest signal function is that in this function two unknown values are there. x and already is the function but along with a and b arbitrary constant values are there. So let us discuss this e is continuous at that point x is equal to 3. This is the question. So first what they have given we are going to consider the solution given f of x is equal to ax plus 1 so here bx plus 3 if conditions are most important 3 so if x is greater than 3 so look at this question so I hope you know that in the last video our last class we have split up the class intervals so here the three conditions are the x is less than 3, one condition. So another condition in this only. So x is equal to 3, right? So here on the separate condition where x is 3, greater than 3. So look at that. Here 3 is only big. 3 is only big. Then others are very small. I hope, try to understand. Next 2. So here. 1 here, 0 here, minus 1 goes on left side, left side. So decreases, right? Decreases means L, H, L. Finally, we got it the value. And at, at already they have given x is equal to 3. So is there. So at another one, x is, so what is the x? So here, look at this one. 3 is only small and others are big 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, so on numbers are increases it means increasing so it means R, X, L finish the problems look at first what we are know that information of the problem pilot the LHL and R next we are going to express at at x is equal to 3. So here at x is mark is another value. So f of x, right? f of x is equal to ax plus 1. Why do you want to take here at x is the condition is there. So this is in the form of polynomial function, right? Polynomial. So already we know that every polynomial function is is continuous. Right? One, a single step. We are going to express for the function. So, what is the x is? 3. f of 3 is equal to a. 3 plus 1 is equal to 3a plus 1. This is the first at that point. Next, what we are going to find out? So, we are going to find out LHL. So, limit x tends to, what is the value? x tends to 3 is there. It means so left hand rule. F of x. So what is the left hand rule? Where is the left hand side? So look at this. What is the condition? A limit apply first limit x tends to 3. Here mention, here don't mention. Right? This is the part of left hand side. Here apply for the limit. So what is the condition? Ax plus 1. So here the substitute value already you know that 3a plus 1. Same things is there. So we are going to express for this one equation number 1. Right? Next R H L. Left and finish. Next I'm going to step for the find out the equation and right hand limit. So here limit x tends to 3 plus y can take plus. It means right hand side. So f of x, 
So limit, first you mentioned the limit, x tends to 3, right hand side goes to here. So check it, that condition. So here, bx plus 3, right? So this is the right hand side. Apply the limit. So 3x, sorry, 3p plus 3, equation number 2, right? Now I'm going to take these two equations are most important. Next, you are going to find out for the L, here I can take L, H, L. So, E is equal to 1 at condition, you can take, or otherwise, L, H, L is equal to R, H, L. Right? So, what is the L, H, L? So, 3, A plus 1, one side, L, H, L, I can take the values, what do you R, H, L? 3, B plus 3, right? So this expression, one sixth that side, 3a minus 3b is equal to 3 minus 1. Sifting property applied. Here 3b comes to this side, right? So left side and 1 goes to that side, right side. The value sign will be changed. So here 3a minus 3b keep answer because both are different numbers. So that don't subtract because here a is there, here b is there. So this one, 2. So here 3 take common. What is the value? a minus b. So here 2 cross multiplication a minus b through by 3. Hence we prove that that is the relation between a and b or a minus b 2 by 3. It is an expression. So this one last year in 2017 they are asking five marks question and most important over they are asking so many times three marks also please try to understand this type of questions are there and we will go to the part in the next class thank you so much try to understand please everyone practice most of this one thank you bye